Hey everybody, this is E3PO from WMClan.net. In this video tutorial, you will be seeing how to successfully create a surf working map. Yes, it is quite simple really. Just model your surf map, portal it like so by adding exact portals. You should know how to do that if you don't look for a video tutorial on halomaps.org. Once you're ready, go ahead and export your map. Do nothing different than you normally would to export it. And save it. Blah, 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 blah. Go ahead and export it. And exit out of Max and load up tool. Okay, now that you have tool loaded up, go ahead and run tool structure levels uh, your map and then space your map just like that okay once it is done you can go ahead and add all your stuff in the tags like uh, let's see scenario make sure you have a sky this set to multiplayer go all the way down to the bottom or add whatever you want in here and well, open up the SBSP once that is open make sure all your collision materials are correct and make sure you have all the weather and fog and the sound and whatever you want in the map then go ahead and run Tool, light maps, levels, Halloween, 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 0, 0 0.9. Okay, once light maps are finished, go ahead and load up the folder, your data folder, and you should see this little debug lightmaps.tiff. Go ahead and open that in paint, it is fine. Uh, Unless you have Photoshop, which I'm going to do it in Photoshop since it's so much easier. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, just like so. Zoom in a little bit, just in case. Go ahead and click on the blue, and then select inverse, and then go up to image. Uh, blah, 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 fill, where's fill? Shift F5 is fill, by the way. And then 50% gray, and then just Control S will save that. Then copy it into your maps folder, like so. And just name it your map.tiff, like that. Okay, now you're ready to load up sapien so go ahead and do that and it's loading on my other screen so I'll have to move it over okay so as you can see it obviously worked successfully got the map in game blah 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 and portaling is all working correctly. Now let's say you've got all of your vehicles and everything ready to go and you want to add a jail. So you have this as your jail. Let's go ahead and add a flag. This anywhere and name it jail. Okay now what we're gonna need to do is get a trigger volume for everywhere that we want people to be teleported to the jail. So let's say if they hit the bottom of this, we'll want them to be teleported to jail. So go ahead and go all the way over here. Make this as long as this room, or longer if you want. Doesn't matter, as long as it is the size of the room. 
blah, blah. Okay, once you've got it covering the entire bottom where you want people to be teleported, go ahead and name it to jail. Okay, now we're going to want to put this other places like in here, but I'm not going to do that in this tutorial as it will take way too much time. Go ahead and load up your data folder. Levels, test, actually no, levels, surf, Halloween. Make a folder called scripts and go ahead and make a new .h. C HSC file. Discard all this, doesn't really matter. This is what you're going to need, and it will be posted with this tutorial. Now, what we're going to want to do is just add one more of these and rename this to uh, jail or to jail. And then we want them to be teleported to jail. It's that simple. Just save it close it, go back into here, control shift C, script successfully compiled. Okay, now also you may notice the shadows are a bit weird, and that's because I forgot to compile the bitmap. So go ahead and do tool bitmaps levels and there you go. Now it should be fine. So we can load that back up. Blah, 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 loading, loading, loading. And as you can see, the lights are better now. Okay, so now that that is done, we can go ahead and uh, go into the globals and make it surfable. Go all the way down to double speed modifier and run forward under player information. Now I'm going to include the .globals file that I use, but you can tweak it to work better for what you want. So we have the uh, walking speed, just the same. Now the double speed modifier is definitely changed. Run forward is definitely changed. And run acceleration is definitely changed. And that's about it, other than airborne acceleration. That's like what keeps you in the air. Okay, so uh, go ahead and compile that by going in here just like that and you have now compiled your very own working surf map yay Good luck and good night. Ch oh yeah, also check out our website, surf.wmclan.net. It is quite a nice little website. We post updates and you can click this little contact button up here. Put in your name, your email, a subject, and go ahead and post a link to your map or whatever you want. Go ahead and just click send. It will send it to my email, as you can see here. And I will quickly get it up for you. Thanks, and goodbye.